Okay, so answers to the entrance ticket on 5D, 5E and 5F. So the first question is you are told to find the equation of the line through points S and T. You know the coordinates of point T and you need to find the coordinates of point S. Uh, so actually, this is simultaneous equations. So you need to solve them simultaneously. So if you make them equal to each other, replace Y in the x minus 5 with 3x minus 13, you're going to get 2x is equal to 8, so x is equal to 4. And then y coordinate is going to be equal to 4 minus 5, which is minus 1. Double check in this, form, in this uh, equation, 4 lots of 3 is 12, minus 13 is minus 1. So point S has coordinates mm, 4 minus 1. Okay, now we need to find the equation of the line passing through these two points. So we need the gradient. So we've got to do the difference in y over the difference in x. So the difference in y, let's pick 2 minus minus 1 and the x minus 4 minus 4. So that gives me 3 over minus 8, so it's minus 3, 8. We just double check by doing a sketch. So if you go to the point with the coordinates minus 4, 2, somewhere here, and then you go 4 to 4 across minus 1 down, somewhere here, then you do get negative gradient. And from minus 4 to 4, that's 8. From 2 down to minus 1, that's 3. So it's 3 over 8 with a minus. That is correct. Okay, so the equation of the line is going to be y minus the y coordinate. So y1 is equal to m times x minus x1. So let's pick uh, point S. So y minus minus 1 is y plus 1. M is minus 3 eighths, and then X minus the X coordinate. Rearrange it, you get 8Y plus 8, and then times the bracket by minus 3, minus 3X three plus 12. So finally, rearranging it, you will get 3X plus 8Y minus 8, so it's 8 take away 12, so it's minus 4. Good. Question 2. Find an equation of the line that passes through the point minus 2, 7 and is parallel to the line y equals 4x plus 1. Write the answer in the following form. So if it's parallel to the line, then the, the gradient is the same, which is 4. So you do y minus the y coordinate is equal to 4x minus the x coordinate, so it's plus 2. So here we just need to expand the brackets on the right hand side and move everything on one side. So I move it on the side, the right hand side, to make my x's positive. Find an equation of the line that passes through the point 3, 4 and is perpendicular to the line 4x minus 6y plus 7. So we need the gradient, so 6y is equal to 4x plus 7 giving me y is equal to 4 6 of x plus 7 6. So the gradient of that line is 2 thirds. So perpendicular gradient is minus 3 over 2. So picking the point 3 4, we have y minus y coordinate is equal to minus 3 over 2, x minus the x coordinate, which is 3. So it's 2y minus 8, is equal to minus 3x plus 9, rearranging it, giving us 3x plus 2y minus 17 is equal to 0. Here you go.